All right, in this video, I'm gonna go over how to load up this Dixie Narco drink machine into that truck with this pallet jack and a little, some pieces of wood. Now, I would not recommend anyone do this if you are a beginner. Um, vending machines, full disclosure, are pretty heavy, so you don't want to do this alone. And best case scenario is you wanna have two people there with you. But for the point of this video, if you're in a bind, I'm gonna show you how to do it. So as you'll see right here, this machine is on four by fours basically, up off the ground so that we can get in with a pallet jack. So you take your pallet jack, you go up in here, right? Let's see, turn that down for you. We're gonna get in between, get down. Now I have it off of those four by fours and then we can bring it down to the end. So right there, it is being controlled by the pallet jack. Now this machine is a little lighter than uh, all the other machines. That's why it's not too difficult, but I'm show you two ways. You could load it with this pallet jack directly, but I like to be safe. Better be safe than sorry, guys. So bring it all the way down here. All right, as you can see, have the old reliable F-250 with the lift gate there. Now, you can get a four by four or you can put together two by fours. You decide. I'm gonna get this in position here. And we'll see how this goes. Close to the gate as possible. Now I put it at a little bit of an angle towards the gate, but how do I get it off the pallet jack? Now some people, if you had two people here, you could slide it up on, but I'll show you. So you then you re block it, take your block, put on the edge of the machine right there, on the other side, once you're good, you let it down, pallet jack down, pull it out. Now that's step one. Now, we have to get that off of those blocks. So simply take it, put a little bit of pressure here. Do that. Now the machine is off the blocks, right? So it's ready to go. Again, uh, you know, most times with drink machines, I like to use the piano dollies because you have four wheels, you can roll it right along. But now, this is the part where probably would be good to have two people. But, that's not here right now. That's not here right now. machines can be obviously a full-size drink machine can be a thousand pounds right 800 pounds get that corner on Again, 
and I've been doing this for eight years, so do not recommend you do this by yourself. But to show you. Now that's on the lift gate. On the lift gate, come over here to our trigger. Who needs a gym membership when you can move vending machines around all day, right? I don't know if you can see it or not, but I have a sheet of metal in the back of that bed. There you go. Manhandle that to the back. Grab a strap, obviously missing a strap. Grab our handy dandy strap. I only use uh, for this, not far. So how long did that take? Eight minutes. Now when you get it to the location, just reverse the process, bring it out, bring it down. You can put it on your, uh, end up a sweat here, down here in humid South Florida. But obviously it'd be nice to have multiple people, but if you're advanced and you need to move your vending machine, that's a way to do it with pallet jacks and blocks. Again, you can use piano dollies, but sometimes you don't have that. So you can move most machines with a pallet jack. If you could only get one, a pallet jack and some four by fours would be there. The only problem is if you're trying to get that through a doorway and you put it on a pallet jack, the tipping aspect of it. But that 276E is strapped and ready to be installed. A nice thing about that machine um, it's obviously it's slim so it can go through the doorways. You don't have to worry about swinging the door. Any questions? Let me know. Remember, don't try to move a machine by yourself and say, Adam, I tried. I tried and the machine fell. They're very dangerous. I have begin. I have dropped machines before, uh, depending on the size of your lift gate. This is a very, uh, a large lift gate compared to the smaller ones that they have available. So if you are not sure, outsource it pay the hundred dollars or whatever it is to have an expert move your vending machine these are heavy and they are unforgiving when they fall they are not going to uh to feel great so hope you like the video hillvending.com forward slash start get the free download course ebook hillvending.com remember until next time keep your drinks cold and your snacks fresh <laughs>